Installing the server is fast and easy with OneRoof software. To be able to register, you must have an organization key from TechSoup Global. If you have the organization key, click the OneRoof server setup.exe to start the install. Choose your language and then click OK. On the welcome screen, click the next button. Read the end user license agreement, select the I accept the agreement radio button and then click next. The next screen is the default path. This is usually just the default settings. Click next once you've decided. The select components screen will allow you to choose components such as icons for the point of sale system. Click next. Then choose the title for the start menu and click next. The Select Additional Task screens will allow you to choose which icons will be added to your computer. After you've decided, click Next. By clicking the Install button, the OneRoof server will be installed on your computer. Click the Finish button to exit the setup and launch the OneRoof server. After the OneRoof software is launched for the first time, you will be given the registration wizard. On the first of four screens, you'll have to choose between being an independent single location or a telecenter, and then click Next. The next three screens is where you will enter your registration information. The first field you'll need to enter is the organization key. The key was issued to you by TechSoup Global. After entering the key, the name of your organization should auto-populate. After the organization name has populated, fill in the rest of the fields as they are all required. And then click Next. On the second of the two screens, you'll provide all the information for the person who will become the administrator of this location. The email provided on this screen will become the administrative username and used to log in to the OneRoof server. Click Next to go to the final registration screen. To finalize your registration, agree to the terms and then click the green Submit button. Once the OneRoof software launches again, you'll be presented with the Easy Setup Wizard. The Setup Wizard takes you through a few general settings which all can be changed later. The first option is how you'd like to bill your customers. Would you like to charge them in advance or charge them at the end? Play and Pay is to charge at the end. Time Code and User Mode is to pay at the beginning. You can do your base tax setup. Step 3 is one of the most important options. It is called the master password. The master password is used on the client stations in times that it cannot connect to the server. Make sure this password is complex and is not known by anybody that you do not want to access your computer systems. Click Next and then on the final screen click Next again and Finish to have the settings take effect. That is how to install the OneRoof server. Please visit OneRoof.com if you have any further questions, and thank you for using OneRoof software.